I think this is spawned. Grixie96 here, back with the Minecraft Hardcore Challenge for January 2015. So, let's begin day number two. So, um, uh, I'm well below my level. I think I've already done the perimeter fully. I'm gonna get a, make a diamond, an iron pick or something. Let's hope, um, I got a comment from Mr. Michael Deering that I had a rough start because I didn't find I don't have any water. I would just like to point out that once I do start my wheat farm, uh, water doesn't matter. I can still grow it uh, without water. I don't need water to grow wheat. If I till and then plant immediately, the soil will stay, soil will stay tilled and then it will grow. So, it'll be a slower growth, but I'm not totally screwed, which is a good thing. So I'm going to start cleaning this area out and start building my underground lair. Oh yeah. So generally when I build this style of an underground base, I do multiple layers of floors like this. But I don't really know that I'll be able to do multiple layers of floors like this. Um, because of the restraint of I have to stay beneath um, y equals 15. So that's at 10, that's at 11. I can maybe get like one more layer done. But that's about the extent of it, I think. <laughs> and I might have realized, uh, no, that wasn't a comment, so I must have shown the coordinates. But I was, I realized I found diamonds in the last episode, and maybe I didn't show the coordinates of them, so they were right here. Th that's the coordinates up there in the left corner of where those diamonds were found if I didn't show them in the last episode. I don't remember if I did or not. <laughs> Gonna get some redstone, not that that really helps me, but whatever. Got a lot of cobblestone. So I'm thinking, I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do for a main food source because I definitely, I don't have bone meal to grow those. Um. Shoot, I should actually really quickly make a stone hoe and do that wheat planting. Just really hoping for that tree to grow. I think. Okay. I think I'm going to make a dark room for some mob drops in this episode, too. Mm, maybe. It depends on a couple things, I guess. Like, yeah, I'm thinking I probably will. But it depends, for sure, on how much work gets done with this base. I don't want to be eating rotten flesh forever, so that's a thing to be worried about. I definitely need to like, get some of that wheat growing. But rotten flesh does work for the time being. 
That disk pick doesn't help you with that stuff. I'm gonna do this. Mobs are gonna start spawning in here. If I undo the torches. They definitely will. So I'm gonna do that. Place some sand. Let it get real dark. I'm gonna make myself... Oh, I have enough to make another diamond pack, so I'm not gonna construct a sword from that. I'm going to make an iron sword at least. So I'm going to do that. And I'm going to... Don Forsake... Oh, there we go, some more iron. What hmm, do I want to do? I can't make a chest yet. So I'm going to organize my inventory a little bit. I just, I don't have the wood to make a chest. Like, not something I'm going to waste wood on. Building blocks will go over here. I don't want to smelt this iron because I don't have eight. That's building blocks. Building blocks, then wood, and wooden -y things are gonna get over here. Then resources over here. Tools in the hot bar. Um, okay. Mob drops right here. Wait a sec. Those are staying hydrated. Some lapis. Those are staying hydrated. More iron, that's a plus. There's gotta be water nearby though. Let's not have stuff spawn in on me. So I'm thinking, there's got to be water somewhere. Over this way, maybe? I'm just going to kind of explore this area a little bit. Oh. While I'm kind of waiting for mobs to spawn. Because there's got to be water around here somewhere if those are staying hydrated. Like, right? Hold on, before we go any further with this, am I just an idiot and those are not hard and hydrated? These are definitely hydrated. Is there water like right there? Two, three, four. Four. Is it 
suppose there could be water over here. There's got to be water nearby. I dug under them. Is water... I thought water hydrated four blocks. Is it eight? I thought it was four. I'm just... I realize I'm probably not in frame at all. I'm sorry about that. Hmm. Whatever. Let's enlarge the area, I guess. Let's enlarge this area. Since this is going to end up being my farm room. My inventory is full. What of this stuff can be made into something better? That doesn't really help me at all to do that. That wheat is growing. That wheat's growing. There's got to be water, but where? Whatever. I can do that, though. And I'm okay with wasting the coal on that. Oh wait, yeah, I can make furnaces for storage, duh. And for the time being... Because I can do this. I can... Store... Cobblestone in a furnace, in the top of a furnace. Since I don't have wood to make chests, I can actually store most things in the top of a furnace. As long as I don't put something in the bottom of the furnace, I don't lose that item. Yeah, um, there we go. Got a bunch of that stuff out of my inventory. Stuff must have spawned by now. Really? Nothing has spawned? I'll deal with it in a bit. I just really want this tree to grow. I'm thinking maybe if I dig out one more block on the ceiling, that'll help. I mean, I've given that tree quite a while to grow, and I'm starting to run out of food. So, I'm going to need to hope for this wheat to grow soon. I have four that are in the midst of growing. Those definitely look hydrated. I need to till that one and see if it untills. There's a good solution. If it doesn't until it's hydrated. That means I have to find the water. Let's till all of these. And see which ones don't until. So those ones untilled immediately. These ones did not until. So I just gotta keep digging this way. I'll turn this into one of my nice round rooms later. There's got to be water. Like, there must be. Be 
because those are staying tilled. Hopefully, maybe that's why it'll lead to the cave. Get some water or something. Hmm. Where is it? Could be like up above? Is that a thing? Hmm, this one untilled. Those two untilled. Nothing. I'm not liking that. But whatever, right? We have some wheat growing though, which is obviously a good thing. I will be able to have food soon. We might have some of this iron. Bunk, bunk. I might need some stone later to make this look nice. So I might as well put some coal in there. How much iron did I just get? I got eight, so that's a full coal. I have plenty of coal. I just... I need to... Did any of those stay hydrated? Is my question. Or stay tilled? Because if they did, that would be friggin' awesome. Because if they stay tilled without something there, that means there's water nearby. None of them did. Okay. So I'm just crazy, there's no water. I thought those looked hydrated. I guess I was wrong. But, oh well. It's not terrible. Shoot, okay, I'm just not gonna move. If I don't move, it won't hurt me too much. I do have that spider eye. So, worse comes to worse. Did that even give me anything? Please stop being hungry. Oh, that wheat's almost grown. The hunger actually, that made me lose a hunger. That made me lose a hunger. So I'm gonna shift around for the rest of this episode, waiting for this wheat to grow. I do have enough now to make another redstone block. I want some mobs to spawn, please. That's not what I meant to do, but okay. Something should have been able to spawn back here. Seriously? That's, I thought I was far enough away from it. Like I should be far enough away for, for stuff to spawn. 
Oh. Hmm. Alright, it's probably gonna roll over soon now, anyways. So, oh, yep, there we go. There's the rollover. So, I'm not doing too bad. I'd like to get some mobs spawning, but if that doesn't happen, it's not the end of the world, because I can still grow that wheat anyways. I just need to start getting the food going, so, eh, whatever. This is GregC96, and I'll see you guys next time. Alright, if you're new to the channel, thank you for watching this video all the way through. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. Comment down below if you'd like to see me do anything in the future. Like the video if you liked it, dislike it if you disliked it, and share it with your friends. It really helps the channel grow. Also, check out some of these previous videos. See you guys next time.